So the Jolly Pirates boat is in the background there. Check in, there's a bunch of signs. It is right next to the Moomba Bar. And if you just keep going straight, you'll see it down there. Hello. 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 There you go. Good afternoon, everybody. Good afternoon. It's going to be a long day. Yeah. Hopefully. All right, we'll see. Welcome aboard the Jolly Pirates. Uh, well, guys, in just a minute, uh, we're going to raise the sails. We're going to go straight to the California Lighthouse. It's the lighthouse over there. Uh, we also gonna try to stop over there somewhere, keeping up so we can uh, we can open the rough swing. We're gonna jump off the rope. So do we have any volunteers that on board? Yeah. Nice. Let's see after a few drinks. <laughs> gonna get a few crazy ones. Okay, and of course on the way back, uh, guys, we're expecting to see a really nice sunset today. It looks really nice, really clear. So we think it's gonna be a good one. If you don't get to see the sunset for any reason. Don't worry about it guys, we get you covered. I mean, it's not nothing like we're gonna give you the money back, no. But you can always go to my fan page on Facebook. I post a few pictures, beautiful sunset last week. You can just copy and paste. <laughs> Take a picture next to the wheel and you can say, I was there. Don't worry, I will give you a like. All right. Um, Right now, let me introduce myself and the crew to you guys, so you know how you can call us. Uh, right here next to me, we got Tony. Hey, Tony. Next to him, uh, we got Angel. Hey. And the one is gonna be your best friend for the rest of the trip, guys. It's gonna be your main bartender. So be nice to him if you know what I mean. Your bartender, Vincent. My name is uh, Julio. <laughs> well, let's see. In a few minutes, uh, guys, we're going to open the bar. Let me tell you what we're going to have today for you, okay? Let's see. Today we got rum, we got vodka, whiskey, gin, red wine, white wine. Vincent can make you like rum punches, piña coladas, and uh, the house drink is the pirate's poison. Okay, that's the drink that wanna make you walk on water back to the pier later on. So you gotta try that one. Really good for the kids. <laughs> they will be sleeping early. You guys can party go to the casino later. Don't worry, guys. Going tomorrow. Uh, let's see. Beside those, we have juices like orange, cranberry, pineapple, grapefruit, tomato, or sodas like Coke Sprite and Diet Coke. But guys, we're gonna be serving the drinks in the small plastic cups, right? Please, really please, especially when we get up there, hold on tight to your plastic cup the whole time. Don't leave your plastic cup anywhere on a them around the boat, on top of the railing, because it can just uh, fly away, fall into the water and become the last meal for a sea turtle or for a dolphin. So we have a trash can next to the bar, one more right here next to me, just put me there. You see one of the boys walking around, give it to them or even better, save it. Bring it back to, you, uh, to the bar to, to your bartender for your next drink. That would be really nice if you guys do that. After the bar, you might need to use, uh, to use the bathroom. Well, look around. This is a pirate ship. So, we feet. Hey, you go. 
Ladies, save your plastic cup. That's easy. Do your thing and flush. Boys, you know what to do. Stand on the balcony and just uh, try to aim downwind. Just be careful with the flying barracudas we have around here because they really love shrimps. <laughs> You can ask your bartender, he knows what we thought of sorry beans. They know a little secret now, buddy. Oh my god. No, we just kidding guys. This way down below the door on your right. It's a marine toilet guys, so please, marine toilet, not like the one in the house, the one at the hotel that you know you press a button and everything is a pre-all and magic. Not on this one you gotta pump a few times. That's the little handle you will see next to you. So please guys, really please, no paper, no plastic in the toilet, use the little basket on the side. Anyway, we're gonna be watching you because we have a small camera in there, so be careful. Right now, just uh, feel free to walk around, you guys can go and check uh, down below anytime you want. You can also lie on the net in front of the boat. Vincent is gonna open the bar in just a minute, so party time and uh, walk up board, guys. Thank you. <laughs> it's only drink one. Continue. We have a few rules. Actually, it's only one, so please follow this rule the whole time. Just make sure you guys let go at the end of the swim. You don't want to end up on YouTube or my Facebook because, yes, I will post it over there if you swim back and you hit the post. Alright, as uh, soon as you hit the water swim, right away back to the ladder. We want to walk this way behind the bar, making the line on the left side of the boat. Someone is going to pick a volunteer, so let's do it.
right, so last night we did the Jolly Pirate Sunset Cruise, and um, that goes out of, it's right in front of the Marriott Surf Club, and um, we chose that. We love sunset cruises. Obviously, we've never been to Aruba, so we've never done one here, but we do them all over the place, and I'm going to be honest, I picked that one kind of based on the price. It was the cheapest sunset cruise that I could find and the reviews were really good and we um, got 20% off they do a 20% online discount if you book your trip on Friday Saturday Sunday or Monday I believe so we ended up saving I think about $12 I'll link or I'll put in the um, receipt but I want to say we paid like 57 or 58 dollars for the both of us and a lot of the other ones that I was looking at was 60 dollars a person or if you were d doing the dinner one it was way more um, so we had a lot of fun um, there was a bar and they had a ton of options like rum vodka whiskey gin um, and they did pina coladas and rum punches and bloody marys and they had something called pirate's poison which was like their standard drink and i think that was vodka and fruit punch what we really liked we were doing um pina coladas and rum punches and we were mixing them and that was really yummy um what else it was so it's the time was 5.30 to 7.30, and it said to be there at 5 o'clock, so we got there just before 5 o'clock, and we checked in, and then we went to walk to the boat, and they said um, that you can't go till 5.20. So I kind of wish I knew that, because we were just hanging around for 20 minutes with nothing to do. I wish they said, hey, just come at 5.20, um, but I guess they do that so people are not stragglers and late which we did have on our boat but I'll get to that um, so 5:30 to 7:30. so we got on the boat and um, they gave us kind of a rundown of what was gonna happen and then we left and what I will say is you're not in the water for that long I mean you're in the water but you're not sailing for that long um, if you aren't on the cruise to drink or to do like the rope swing maybe it's not for you because so you leave from Marriott Surf Club and you end up docking at the um, German shipwreck which is not far I don't know how far but it's not far like maybe you're maybe we were sailing for 10 minutes maybe I don't know it was not a long time at all so the majority of the time we were docked at the ship rock shipwreck and people were um, jumping off the rope swing um, so it was a lot of fun I would definitely go back and do it again but if you aren't there to drink it, you might not like it because they didn't even point out like hey sun's starting to go down why don't you take some pictures it was just we were docked at that same spot and that was it and then when it was time to go I want to say we left the spot a little after 7 and we docked at like 7 15 um, and that was it so it was definitely a lot of fun I would do it again the the staff was really nice they came around um, I think two different times and you know tried to take pictures for everyone um, they were friendly and you know they tried to joke with you I liked them a lot so I would definitely recommend it um, but that would be kind of my only critique is we really didn't sail it's kind of just drink as much as you can and jump on the swing I didn't go to get wet I wanted we were going to dinner afterwards I wanted to just kind of enjoy the sunset and have fun have a couple drinks um, I probably maybe I would try a different um, cruise next time I was here just to check it out but I loved this one and I would do it again in a heartbeat 
So let me know if you have any questions and I will do my best to answer them. All right, bye.